It's cardio challenge day six. Every year I start the summer out by doing a 30 day cardio challenge. This year, unfortunately, I broke my femur in April. So my cardio challenge is gonna look a little different personally. I want you guys to join me. I'm gonna show you what I'm doing. I want you to show me what you're doing. 30 minutes a day of cardio for 30 days starting June 1st. Let's go. If I'm being completely honest with you guys, I have some weird and uncomfortable swelling on the medial side of my leg today, which is not the incision side, which is annoying. Uh, maybe I've been overdoing it. Maybe one of the uh, pins they put in my leg is getting caught on my muscles. So I don't know, something weird's going on. So I'm gonna take her a little bit more easy today. Uh, I'm gonna try to ride my bike just up on the dirt road, my mountain bike up on the dirt road. If that doesn't go well, I'm gonna cycle back down here and use the hand cycle again, uh, cause John let me borrow it. So that's today's approach. Hopefully the, we'll be able to just get her done on the mountain bike, but if my knee's really bugging me, I'm gonna come back. just get out there and it would start feeling better but the further I go the worse it feels actually I think I'm gonna do the old flip about and go get the hand bike and ride that thing luckily I have it Whew. round two cycling day and try this one out this one's not gonna mess with my leg day two in a row my second day ever riding a hand cycle and I suck at it still so it didn't get easier from yesterday I didn't improve overnight guys it's so weird so weird So that's a wrap on day six cardio challenge. And also a, little, a good little poignant moment for an update on my leg recovery, because uh, I'm almost six weeks out of femur, uh, getting a rod put into my femur, which was broken pretty badly. And uh, I would say the first five days of the cardio challenge went amazing. I was feeling great. I think it was just really good for my body to get my heart pumping and start start doing things that a normal athlete that I would normally do as an athlete. Um, and today is the first day that I got, really got some pushback from my body on that. Where um, I don't know if it's something I overdid or I, I don't know if it's something else that's going on in my leg, but man, it is just super swollen today. I feel like I've taken two steps back. So that's challenging for sure. I think the hardest part about recovering from something is that daily grind of feeling like you're not getting any better. Um, and so I'm just taking this moment to kind of remind myself even though it was harder for me to get the same range of motion that I've gotten in the past today, my bone is still healing. The bone, you know, doing these circles on the spin bike, doing the circles on the road bike, riding my mountain bike a little bit, uh, is all bringing blood flow to that bone and, and the bone is healing. So that's the, that's the short term goal anyways, is just to heal that bone. The long term goal being of course, get back to 100%. So uh, maybe a minor setback for me up here but in the long run, I'm focusing on the long-term recovery. So uh, things are going, they're going good. If you had asked me that two hours ago, I would have been maybe slightly frustrated and upset, but doing pretty good here. And uh, thanks for tuning in to day six. See you guys tomorrow.